Anyway, that is the predictions. And now you are here, Jay. We can uh, bring in a brand new feature that you will enjoy. Um, is there a new feature song? Yes. There is. Oh, oh, there's it. Oh, there is. Don't you worry. It is oh, my this. God. Say it with Jay, say it with Jay, if you want to know the baseball lingo. Say it with Jay. There you go. It is Say It With Jay. <laughs> <laughs> so the, right. the, the background to this for all of you uh, wonderful podcast listeners is that we um, regularly enjoy watching games together for our Zoom watch-alongs. And um, obviously Hannah, Dom and myself, us, British fools will often refer to things and pronounce things in ways that Jay, in his strident American way, likes to pull us up on. So say it with Jay is Jay giving us all an education. But this time, in the first edition, Jay, we are going to go for a word that you, in fact, have come up with. And I am going to show it to you on a bit of paper. Okay. And you need to spell it out and explain how to say it and why. And I should probably go uh, give the give a little bit of backstory on yes. this word as well. And there's no other format. Like I can just start talking. No, it's fire away. It's your section, awesome. Jay. So uh, the word people, that are, a lot of our listeners are going to be like, "That's not a word. Jay just made that up." Well, this is baseball, and I'm American, so I can make up words. Um, the word the word is rispinato. Um, that is R I S P I N. There might be a apostrophe after that. I'm not sure. And then A T O. Um, so basically, uh, this, the, this word dates back or its roots, uh, date back, uh, to Latin, maybe 2019, 2020, <laughs> uh, the Oakland A's, uh, UK group, started talking about Rispin because they were reading the word or they're reading RISP or runners in scoring position just, you know, as if it's a word that people say, but I, I've never heard anybody say RISP before. <laughs> um, and so RISP became Rispin because apparently that's, what you do when you're when when you get a hit with runners in scoring position, then I guess you're you're risping away, um, you're risping away. and uh, it became a song. Um, I believe it's got two songs now. Now yeah. that uh, now that it's been translated into uh, or developed into rispinato. Yeah. So rispinato is rispin and two outs. So <laughs> runners in scoring position in and two outs. Uh, and uh, yeah, because you know that's that's the that's the time uh, when you have the most effect on the outcome of a game. If you can get a hit with runners in scoring position and two outs, uh, and uh, yeah, that's what Rispinato Rispinato means. Uh, it's got there's a little song based on Desperado. Uh, uh, Rispinato, why don't you come to your senses and stop swinging for fences? Um, I'm not going to try to hit all the notes and sing it. Uh, maybe if you catch me during a watch along and I've had a few to drink, then I might try to do that, but not, <laughs> yeah, not geez. actually singing it. You can, uh, I will make a video of it, Jay. I will do, I will record a version <laughs> and make a video for you. I, yeah, I just want to uh, add, add Rispinato, Rispinato, you know, it's, yeah, it's, it's pastor or pastor. This is definitely this is definitely an American word, and it's pronounced rispinato because uh, rispinato is not that's that's not the song. It's not desperado, uh, <laughs> rispinato, and also it kind of sounds a little Italian. You know, like yeah, but uh, if you're from New York though, you might just say rispinat because you don't pronounce the uh, like oh let me get some mutz let me get some mozzarella. Uh, some prosciutto, some rispinato. <laughs> um, yeah, so rispinato. That's uh, say it with Jay. Rispinato. Say it with Jay. The first edition. Thank you, Jay. There we go. <laughs> this is going to become one of our most popular features, I am sure. 